Hey, Josh. Thanks for coming today. I'm really excited to talk to you about SAP on AWS. Thanks, Kimberly. It's great to be here. Now, we'd love to hear from you and what you're seeing out in the marketplace of who's moving to SAP on AWS. Well, I have to admit I'm impressed because the question is better asked almost who isn't or who couldn't because the, the, the breadth of, of companies and business cases for moving and technological reasons for moving it's so broad, honestly, that, that is, it's, it's, it's pretty much anyone. So I'd like to talk about that a little bit, about how important is you know, your change management strategy and really getting those users on board? Just the most important part of it, other than the technology, which is fundamentally easier than people, as a matter of fact. I find that really the, the, the biggest point of friction and the potential for problems comes with the, the lack of engagement or mm -hmm. the inability to really bring the customer and its business users into the picture early, as early as possible and as thoroughly as possible. And I think that that's, you know, that's an essential part of the engagement for any project to be successful is to make sure that those people actually get to use the stuff um, are the ones who, who, who understand it. And I think, I think that's one of the benefits of moving to the cloud is you, you, know, you, can, you can sandbox these things. You can do mm -hmm. a lot of presentation, if you will, of what, what would the reality look like uh, right. down the road. What's this actually going to, to you, the business user, how is, how is your job going to change? What's, what, what, what are the interactions you're going to have to make with the system? And, and, and by staging that, you engage them. And by engaging them, you give them ownership. And by giving them ownership, you're increasing the chance of success by orders of magnitude. And the other, you know, the other people in the equation are the partners as well. And mm -hmm. this, you know, I know this is a big part of your, your world. Absolutely. Um, I think one of the things I, I'm impressed is that you guys at, at Amazon have really figured out how to how to vet these partners and find the right ones and make sure that their success is your success as a customer's success. Right, with our partner network and, and work, working with our customers, we really recommend them looking at partners as they're going through this process, whether it be the large integrator, some of the regional players, whether it be working with SAP or SAP Max Attention, or even working with our own AWS professional services. Really having that partner being another input into the process. And I think there's a lot that your people can learn from working with the partners. So once you have done the migration, if there's any type of cutoff from that perspective, you've really enabled your teams during the process as well. So uh, definitely with the, with the Amazon Partner Network and the competencies that come through that from an SAP perspective as well as a cloud perspective, I think are very important as you're taking on this journey. Yeah, I think, you know, and the thing, the trick is really, you know, you want partners who are cloud savvy, who are Absolutely. cloud native. Josh, thanks so much for your time today. I really enjoyed our conversation. Me too. It's been really a lot of fun. Thanks.